friends, Reckless Tempest here. Today we're going to be playing Lucian on Legendary Mode. Uh, we will be doing Retire Run Scumming, just to make sure we have appropriate number of rerolls going later on into the challenge. I think, like, if you're playing normal or hard, you don't really need to Retire Run Scum. At Heroic, it's kind of like... The game's like kind of silly hard, so you know you can be a bit of a, a miser in return. Actually, we'll probably keep cavalry just because it's really good against spiders. Very good hit. Very, very nice draw. Yeah, and Poros is just broken. I don't know if I was like. Yeah, I don't think I actually talked about the pick in any way, but yeah, Porus is just absolutely unhinged. There's a kill in the air. I'm just gonna block with the Poros to crank Lucian up. Also, we're effectively trading our free power with their, like, mana, so a pretty good exchange. We're gonna let Exalted Poro die. Um, and they're filling up. Level up. Level up. A cooking. Mm, a delicious challenge. Don't duck on my account. I'm surprised they didn't kill anything. Can't wait for this withering whale though to blow me up. I'm just gonna open attack just in case I actually do have a withering whale. I know they run it, that, uh, we get the auto-heal, at least, uh, this way. Side by side, into battle. Now we can use, a uh, single combat. Remove, a. Uh... Can you stomach this? Do your work. I'm, I'm killing War Chef, so we get the token. And then we get to attack for lethal. Burn away the shadow. Can't bite on an empty stomach. Smashy, smashy. Really want to see a good arena run with Twisted Fate. Seems like they give you so many draw mechanics that might not be a bad pick. I think I've only been able to pick. Yeah, yeah, in labs. Uh, oh, <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> I was gonna say, I rarely see TF, and here he is. <laughs> um, Honestly, he's like... I don't know. I could try it. Um, Like, the problem is that Nivea is just such an awful pick. And, like, I think 6, like, with... Uh, Darius in one of the earlier runs was like kind of the limit. Like, I've never played a Trindomir, nor do I really want to. It's just funny the way that all lined up. Yeah, yeah, let's take a uh, TF. <laughs> Yeah, I kept both of these just because they're, um, Mist Wraith removal. 
Maybe I didn't need to keep both. Just because uh, we can't really play them. Well, I guess we could go turn 4. Vanguard, turn 5, Vanguard. Yeah, the second one's probably a little excessive. Kinda glutted. But, eh. Probably should have mulled one of these to uh, dig a little deeper. Yeah, I don't think I sequenced this properly. Hmm. Very weird curve we got there. Yeah, but I probably should have just put, like, um... Um... Uh, one of the one ones on the ephemeral. Bomb beast. Cavalry. I'm actually just fine with this. Okay, so we can play Vanguard. And, um, now we can level up Lucian. Full, full, full. Maybe we should have single combated the Doom Beast with uh, cavalry. So we'd have another uh, challenger left. They got nothing. spatula so from what i remember it gives a combination between plus two plus one one or uh, zero two and it adds keywords so i don't know this is just this is just cool <laughs> um yeah so i'm gonna take it <laughs> there's there's no no greater logic than than that and yeah yeah like like it might get higher than two two health from spatula more often so we can do broken shit uh we can deck in this game mode but our deck size should get bigger than gambler can kill us Part of me wants to just take tough vanguard, but I don't think we need to do that just because we have poros. So I might actually just take back to back. Yeah. Just as like a powerful spell effect. And I think I was harping on Darius earlier, but at the very least, then um 
in the lab, uh, well, just in Runeterra, I mean, you can be easier on, uh, spells being expensive, because you can bank spell mana, so. Like, Runation can cost nine. Will be playable. Yet again, they hit Shark Chariot. I wonder if we're just getting, like, crazy luck, or if they've, like, tweaked Thrash so it can't hit a living two, uh, like, a, a Soul Shepherd on turn two, on turn one. I'm, I'm probably just being lucky. Easiest answer. <laughs> not take mega damage actually maybe yeah this is probably better we just radiant strike the soul shepherd down clear their board they get spiderlings but yeah slowing down their vaults pretty good Senna here. <laughs> that, uh, was a bad block. <laughs> oh, they only have, do they only have one Soul Shepherd? Uh, let's blow this up so they can't vault into. Deal me in. Something for all of you. This is a brutal beatdown. All right, all right. We we have big, big flux. Big, big flux energy. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, uh, I don't. I don't think flexible game plan should be a thing in the game. This power sucks. Um, Dragon's Rage isn't bad. It's not great though. And fast steel is a fine power, but it's really bad when you play against Hexcore, which is one of the uh, um, like harder matchups. So I'ma just reroll. Fast steel is the meme dream. It is a meme with TF. For sure, but I don't think we can pivot too hard into TF. Um, current setup. Just as a Lucian deck, right? Yeah, yeah, I'm a reroll. The Fairy in my 8 5 plus. We only have, what, one? Varian's Rage again, kind of meh. Brit. Is my power to match my health. We would like the other one. Alright, so we got the classic... Classic powers. Um, is my health to match my power? Actually kind of good with... Um, Lucian and Senna. Kind of keeping them... Off, but like attacking constantly is kind of stupid uh, let's take cataclysm because we have a lot of uh, quick attackers so we can kill stuff easier than with single combat and like single combat is like kind of tricky to set up right 
Alright, so against a Hunter deck. Wanna go easy on plays until uh turn two. After turn two we can do some stuff. But like at the end of turn two after they play their stupid archer. Kind of funny, this dodge the vulnerable trigger. Don't get in my way. Scout. What the? This is mercy. Feels bad, man. <laughs> Feels Batman. I'll write my own story. Yeah, I might just red card and then pilfered goods. Deal me in. And uh chump these for a bit. I can barely keep up. Do it we draw. Crash. <laughs> yeah, block's fine. All right, so we have a TF in play. We have one more cavalry we can draw. Great, right? that's the that's the hit. I guess it's not on. Yeah, it's actually fine, right? Like we get we get it out of our deck. We don't necessarily want to draw it. We accelerate our TF ass here like a 5-3 is relevant I mean a 3-3 is relevant because of the 5-3 yeah put some damage on Yeah, that's fine. Fine. I guess we could single combat the Elnuk. But we might have to save this just to kill this later. Yeah, I think we I think we actually have to save this. We are leaving some Elnuk value on the table. Letting an 8 power over Walmer Loaf is uh, not the best for business. So, 7 mana. I kind of forgot about Take Heart. If they have a Take Heart here, we're in a lot of danger.
All right, let's single combat over here and prismatic EF. Honestly, I should probably prismatic the Uh, yeah, let's hold on to this. Eight. I wonder if we could just mill them if we get enough pilfered, um, pilfered goods. In the run, like overall. Um, yeah, I think I'll attack with TF, <clears throat> since, um, we have Radiant Strike. Maybe we could attack with a little more. Wait, let's just do this. Now we level up TF. Whiff. Up there in the Soak it in. Because there's no five power card left. Still fine. Uh... Yep, that's fine. Pass Serena. Very lucky we kind of got a chance to shift them around. Just got to use back to back to make sure Alpha doesn't trample over. This is a fucking meme. <laughs> go, Slotbots, go. Ah, I missed I missed lethal, whatever. <laughs> what did we get? Means we get to fucking hit him again with Slotbots. <laughs> Alright, so uh, TF there was actually kind of surprisingly reasonable. of the round when you deal the enemy nexus now i'm not taking that card there's no fucking way i'm taking that card uh stony suppressor is actually very intriguing since um how do i say this it's like the hex core deck and the turret deck kind of get it's more the hex core deck kind of gets hobbled by this Problem is, we actually have what? Two, four, six, eight, twelve. Twelve spells aren't like, like, we also get hobbled. I, I don't want to take loaded dice. I, I don't like nab. I think it's a little overrated. Ooh, I do want to try this out though. Could really. Yeah, I think. I think the Stony Suppressor could be gas. Um, 
I'm just gonna upgrade our single combats to help us ensure that we can kill the early units opponents don't play with. And also Poro Snacks on Prismatic Barrier is like whatever when we already have little buddies. We don't know how the spatula is going to spin. So maybe it's reasonable to... Um, keep Radiant Strike if Lucian goes down to two. I think I can... Elusive? That's not fair. This is bullying. This is e bullying. Fire knows so. Um, yeah, I guess we go for the Radiant Strike single combat. Maybe Sithria single combat's better. I don't want them getting this off and then, you know. You know how this works, right? <laughs> all this stuff gets big, all of our stuff dies, this stuff stops taking damage, it's just no good, it's no bueno. I guess we just block with, like, Challenger, Poro, and Radiant Strike it? Strike hard, strike true. Straight off. Up to two. Yes. Is mercy. We're in no rush to pull for goods as long as we have cards. I don't know, maybe this, that was a little loose, but I'm too used to, like, competitive play where it's like, every time they don't do the thing, it's like, alright, time to punish. <laughs> Lucian. Damn it. Uh, you know, I'm gonna... Yeah, I guess Radiant Strike's the, the thing. We're gonna be taking some damage here. I guess we should be able to kill him. Yeah, we just block up. Have something single combat here to kill the this one, take no damage, kill him. Yeah. They would need elixir of iron to cuck us. Regardless, that block was probably fine. <laughs> Maybe. Alright, 24, not bad. Not bad.
Uh, exhaust is, like, very reasonable, right? Um, you know, one man at a cycle is already pretty powerful. I, I, I keep bringing it up, but having a way to kill Yips, having a way to, like, set up good attacks, you know. Good stuff. Like, we're not a good mind melt deck. For Demacia is kind of meme -y. Don't get me wrong. Uh, especially because we have little buddies and it makes a little buddy, but... I think Exhaust is clearly the pick. We're on Legendary, we are trying to win. I am, uh, as the kids say, try-harding. Okay, back-to-back -back cast twice is kind of fucked up. That's, that's a little, uh... That's, that's, that's fucking... Huge. Actually, these are all very good, right? just think Phage with, uh, Vanguard is, like, too good to pass up. Like, two, two, four, three challenges for four mana. Like, oof. I think it's gotta be this. Uh, like, one mana Lucian's good. But, uh, I think... I gotta go with the Vanguard. Like, in, in, and we have Domination, so, like, I don't know. I want to say the difference between a 1-mana and a 2-mana Lucian isn't, like, super crazy. But. Yeah. But it's also, like, a 50% reduction in cost. So it's kind of hard for me to... Um, go too far either way. This card's a big bitch. They are coming out of the gates this game. Alright, at least we got lucky they're attacking. Get the Radiant Strike killed us. Hopefully. If they Furia the North, that'll be like so outrageous. Ember Maiden, holy fuck, I'm losing my mind. <laughs> Burn away the shadows. Yeah, let's smash. <laughs> I think I bank actually. It's like the 2-2 two is not very relevant. Definitely leveling Lucian. No point in blocking here since uh, it has Trample. I kind of don't mind Radiant striking here so it lives, so it can, like, put damage on something else later. The only issue is we don't level up Lucian that way. Maybe this is the block, just so we get the token. I guess that's fine. Also, our Lucian has Fury, which is kind of... yeah, okay. Also, I guess another perk for uh, upgrading Lucian is that 
sooner he's in play, the sooner he can see all the Poros get murdered. Danger. Alright, nice turn five win. Not gonna lie. Yeah, these vanguards are fucked. <laughs> it's almost like they need Phage just to scale into Sejuani. Like this is the power curve. I guess like regularly Vanguard only kills like tiny weenie stuff. Whereas now it can trade with stuff. Alright, so duelist. Yeah, it lets you kill the good units. You know, we have a lot of good attackers too. So letting them kill stuff is good. It's pretty it's pretty pretty easy um yeah let's just take a twin shadows Lucian we could take uh, tough as well honestly but I really like the twin shadows also I it's probably a bit of a downside that we got spatula but like if we're gonna get too challenging like it, now that we have duelist right like we can trade off the twin shadow All right, here comes the big, the big test. Do we get yipped? Before we go into this game, if you like the content, please click like. Decimate that subscribe button, all that good stuff. <laughs> um. There. War Chefs is actually probably a little better now. Hmm. Don't do it. Okay, looks good. Lump of Wumps. So you see what I mean with how Twin Shadows and Spatula works weirdly? So I think what happened... This is mercy. Just stack, essentially. Tough Ephemeral Fury. Yeah, so it gave it another keyword. Yeah, so I think Spatula triggered twice, so I was actually wrong. It's just pure upside. Looking grim. Oh yeah, now we get to straight cut them with Stony Suppressor. Because their deck just has such such a hard time working. Wait, you have to pay mana. I'm not gonna lie, for when I was doing this, I thought it was a war chefs. Uh, I'm just gonna bank.
I don't want to give him a chance to attack, and I'd rather just trade off with the Poro. Where are you at? Look at them. Look at them. At it. Uh, let's just barrier. Actually, don't want to draw cards. Yeah, we're still at eight, so we're not gonna burn. Yeah, fine. Scare me. You can just replay him. Indeed. Indeed, your favorite card, Stony Suppressor. <gasps> Life steal. You want excitement? You gotta leave the city. Hello, love. Wait, what the fuck? So Spatula set it to a one four, and then Spatula. Ah, uh, okay. This is mercy. Yeah, underground nerd. Why is Stony Suppressor your favorite card? Am I attacking properly? No, I'm definitely not. I should have pulled it there. Sony suppresses the chat of lore. It's hard to it's hard to argue. Look at that chiseled chatness. Wait, are we about to beat fucking Hexcore without taking damage? On legendary. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, I get to attack again. And you already had the token. Oh, we can't kill him. There's a finite amount of fun in a card game match. Stony Suppressor takes all the fun for yourself. So you maximize their fun. It's true. You take their fun. By taking their fun, you... It's like the conservation of energy, right? And fun's not destroyed. It just gets transferred to another recipient. <laughs> yeah, holy shit. That was, uh... We, we fucked Hexcore. That was fucked up. It might be a crime in some countries. Um, all right, so we're playing against turrets. What do we? What do we want? Um, I think barrier Sethry is like probably the efficient play. Like, or the yeah tough Sethria, but I don't know. Santa's good. Yeah, let's just take Senna. Right, so now we just gotta dodge Heimerdonger. Actually, fun can be critic because he should have with us multiplying it. Ah, touche. Facts, facts. Why 
Well, I guess the, the theory of the conservation of fun is a very complicated uh, field of study. This isn't even correct, right? This is the play? I'm no longer having fun. Yeah, we attacking for <laughs> No, they're gonna get another turret. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna play Sethera. We're gonna single combat Heimerdinger. Yeah. Oh god. I'm actually here. You are actually here. Yes, we know. Alright, kill, kill that man. Kill that man. Ah, uh, maybe I was just supposed to play the three. Uh, maybe I got a little too fancy. Sethry is going to lead the Horus Heresy against the Moss, yeah? Well, yeah, like, if Spectral Matron keeps putting her into the 10-mana version into play, right? That... Um... This is a real spin to win. Apparently it's the same guy that did the early 40k stuff. Like, you mean art, or...? Yeah, let's snipe off the stupid zero one. Writer? For legal for League of Legends, Rune Terra, or both. Shut up, I'll, I'll do what I want. Not the boss of me. Uh, I guess we just see that. Right. We could just single that. Oh no. Getting a little nervous. Sixteen. Maybe we go to ten for some true shot barrages. Yeah, let's do it like this. Probably gonna have to use Senna defensively. Phage plus Vanguard is stupid. I have determined it. Yes. 
Uh, alright, so we have to single combat in response to Fizzle Reckless Research. Um, we'll just take the 3-3 three, three down. What are we playing after this? We have 5 mana. And yeah, we'll just play Senna. Let's just take down the... It doesn't really fucking matter. Thoughtbot is the Circus of Alleys from Bioshock. Changed my mind. Um, fair enough, checks out. Can't argue with those facts. Should I have played this? Yeah, probably. Yeah, I probably should have played this. Let's play cavalry. Feeling, feeling bold. Nacho ranch bold. Yeah, we heal slot bots so we get more spins. That seems good. Um, yeah, let's single combat. Let's, let's make sure this doesn't fucking happen. We need to kill this stupid thing. Stupid 6-1 elusives. Bam, bam, bam. Alright, Dinobot. Um, yeah, this doesn't double up. Go play Senna. Uh, what does our open look like? Feel the sizzle. Play there. Purity and peace. What does this look? Is this good? This win the day. Uh, fives, two fives. Blood. Yeah, back to back kills them. GG. Get out. Leave. Leave, please. Alright, I think Victor's actually gonna be kinda tough. I think there's... I think there's room to lose. Especially if they get, like, the Armored Gear head start. Hmm. Very underwhelming. I'm just gonna use a reroll here, cause like I'd rather we get something cool. <laughs> I guess a three three Sithri is like kinda neat and good at yeah, I guess this is fine, right? Like we just smash it into ballistic bot and we can kill it in two turns. Fuck it, I'm rerolling. This? Not bad. Wait, no, she already has Challenger. What am I on? Maybe we just take... Sure, let's just have four single combats that draw two. Pegasus agrees with the reroll. Yeah, this is fine. Alright, we potentially have a game plan. Thank you, Mr. Thank you, Mr. Victor. <laughs> we'll pass. 
guess. We'll just chump. So our Stony Suppressor is not quite... It's too chat for us right now. They only have one mana up. I think we got a... Um... Uh, just joined. Uh, he just joined us for the end. So we got... We got Lucian and Twisted Fate. And we started with Little Buddies, Domination, and Duelist. Yeah. Uh, after this, we're gonna try a normal mode run. No, no, I'm gonna try the challenge where I only pick normal powers. We're gonna go on normal and or common. I'm only gonna pick common. It's gonna be like for all common. So no rares, no epic picks. We're gonna see how that is. Anyways, attack. Alright, let's bank these until we can get TF into play then. We're just gonna gold card. TY TY. Thank God, this is, uh, stunned. So much to play for. Actually, we can do single combat here, right? So TF can use quick attack to kill a ballistic bot. So, I'm feeling confident we can probably trade off slot bot Victor. Let's see what happens next. X core and flash. All right. And shooty shoot. Not bad. Um You know, maybe with this on the stack, we just do it now. To make sure... Yeah, I don't mind this. It just simplifies everything. Have you beaten Heroic Mode with every champ? No, I haven't. Um, I think Braum, Ekarim. There's like two more. Where you at? Five? Are we gonna burn? We're gonna draw too many cards. It's not fair. Guess I'm just fucking blind. <laughs> Push back the darkness. Chumpy chump. Four shafts. today with Callista. Nice. Alright, let's open with a single combat. And flip TF here. 
Yeah, yeah. I, I, I forgot on her. Alright, so we flip TF. <laughs> Lucian's at 2 out of 4. 3 out of 4. That's good. <gasps> Alright, uh. This is kind of cool. We need more coffins. All for this shit. Shafts. You know, let's get Sith in on this. Let's just, uh, execute our two while we're at it. This is for turning into a 10-10 that gets Spectral Matron. Alright, GG. We did it. Um, yeah, Poros are good. Oh, no. What were some other key points? Stony Suppressor beat Hexcore, it felt like. Just like completely, like, neutered them. Yeah, we won with TF. TF actually was good. TF was very reasonable in a few games. It's actually like... Yeah, yeah, he, he did work. Uh, Spatula was super good with Lucian. Twin Shadows, just... No classic goodness. Unfortunately, I can't really... Look. Yeah, and Phage is just... Phage is dumb. Phage is stupid. So yeah. If you like this content, please click like, click subscribe for more Legends of Runeterra Lab of Legends goodness, and I'll see you next time.